It's also a busy night in the BCHL. The Alberni Valley Bulldogs are in West Side. The Nanaimo Clippers visit the Prince George Spruce Kings, and the Cowich and Valley Capitals are in Surrey. Now, if any of those Surrey Eagles dare take any liberties on Caps leading scorer Mike Hammond, well, they're going to have a whole lot of Brendan McDonald to deal with. Uh, he is our MVP of the week. Here's Andrew Johnson with his story. <laughs> One look at the subtle contours of his nose tells you Brendan McDonald has dropped his gloves more than once. So I gotta put up my dupes every once in a while. But the Cowichan Valley Capitals penalty minute king coming in at 118 minutes through 49 games is no goon. The Calgary product has quickly climbed the depth chart to the top. And has uh, steadily improved for our team and, and now is uh, on the first line with uh, with Nick Anderson and Mike Hammond and, and is fitting in that line uh, you know, quite well and, and uh, has, has a role and, and continues to improve every game. And that role includes blocking shots, finishing checks and freeing up space for his line mates to work their magic. Uh, recently I've been playing with uh, Hammond and he's our leading goal scorer so I kind of got to protect him a little bit out there. Anybody trying to bug him, I got to tell him to hit the road, I guess. The 18-year-old hopes he looks a bit like Darcy Tucker out there and says he most admires power forwards like Jerome Aginla. But even though McDonald hails from Alberta, the Flames are number two. I'm more of a Red Wings fan because that's where my grandma's from. And now our MVP of the week is making grandma proud with an attitude his teammates say is team first, Brendan McDonald second. Always been a team guy, stuck up for everyone, just works hard. He's on his way up now and it's good for him. He's, uh, you know, uh, on his way to, to become a, a great player in this league. A league he says he scouted before choosing the BCHL over playing junior on the prairies that has treated the scrappy forward to an unexpected bonus off the ice. Being on the prairies is just awesome to come out here with all the trees and the water all the time. Like it's just a really, really nice place to live. And it's also nice to not have as much snow as we got in Alberta too. He does hope to shovel the puck into the back of the net more regularly with the postseason in sight and end his first campaign at the big stick deep into the playoffs. In Duncan, Andrew Johnson, A Sports.